Without the contributions of Albert Einstein, our world would be a totally different place. Whether it is theory of relativity or the photoelectric effect, Einstein helped us understand the deepest mysteries of the universe. So the question here is, was Albert Einstein just a normal person or was his brain different from us which made him a genius? Let's find out. Previously, I explained how Einstein's brain was stolen by a pathologist named Thomas Harvey during the autopsy. He kept his brain in a jar in his basement for over 40 years and after 40 years he decided to return the brain back to scientists. And when scientists examined the Einstein's brain, they were surprised to see that Einstein's brain was different from a normal person in two ways. When scientists examined Einstein's brain, they were shocked to see that Einstein's brain was missing a particular wrinkle called parietal operculum. And as a result of it, the size of Einstein's parietal lobe was increased by 20%. Parietal lobe is the area of our brain which is responsible for our mathematical skills and our personal ability to imagine things. So we can say that Einstein's ability to imagine things and his mathematical skills were slightly better than a normal person. Second thing that scientists discovered in Einstein's brain was that his brain had 17% more neurons compared to a normal person which means that more synapses were being fired in Einstein's brain and that was giving him more brain power. So apart from Einstein's love for science, we can also say that Einstein's brain was different from a normal person. And if you wanna watch the last video I did on Albert Einstein, I will link it in the description. And I hope that you learned something new today and I will see you in the next video.